We're trying to make it as zero waste as possible, so the way we did that was through like finger foods, like cookies and bruschetta, and then we also are using all of the trash cans recycling and a compost bin. That compost bin takes all of the extra food waste from people who don't finish their food, and then that will go to uh, waste management where they will turn that into compost. I've had so many students come up and ask me what regenerative farming is, and I've already told about 10 people what it is, and they think that it's such a great idea. So just from my small booth, I've already seen a lot of people learning today. Even just to change one person's idea on how they view the environment and how USD can help the environment, um, a lot of us grow up kind of blinded from it, and I just hope that one person today learned something, and I think a couple more than one did. Sustainability for us is eliminating waste, in the coffee industry, especially commercially, uh, the amount of waste is, is off the charts because of you know too much product being brewed, uh, sitting too long, all the handling issues. So what we've done in the background here, we have our van, uh, we do a lot of cold brew, but we also do a new idea called Hot Draft, and it's featured here in San Diego with our, our partner Beverage Factory. And what it is is we make all the products ahead of time, we keg them kind of like the beer industry, but we have our mochas, our lattes, our coffee, and every ounce gets consumed. Looking how climate change is happening and global warming is happening, we have to be willing to make those steps and those changes in our lifestyles to reverse the effects of climate change.